Well, new tonight, a valley man has building blocks that can actually survive tornadoes. The guy who sells green building supplies is now getting a lot of attention for those blocks. William Pitts joins us. And William, his home, I guess, managed to stand and survive when those tornadoes ripped through Alabama. Yeah, it really did. And there's one reason for that. It's not a stick-built home. Uh, there's no wood in these homes. Instead, it's concrete, foam, and rebar, and it'll survive 200-mile-an-hour winds. We have utter destruction. We have neighborhoods that have basically been removed from the map. This is what was left of Tuscaloosa, Alabama. These deadly tornadoes, uh, some of the worst that we've seen in decades, we took mothers and fathers, sons and daughters, friends and neighbors, even entire communities. Whole neighborhoods destroyed by a monster tornado. You could hear it coming, it was real loud, just a roaring. And then we could hear the house uh, coming apart. But in the middle of a wrecked neighborhood, a single house still standing. And they said, Dan, you need to get down here. Your houses are standing tall, and the rest of them are gone. Dan Chenard's EF blocks had survived a direct hit by a tornado. They're a mix of plastic, concrete, and ground up styrofoam, all recycled. Life was green when green wasn't cool. You build a wall with them, fill the holes with concrete and rebar, and Dan says they'll stand up to 200 mile an hour winds, just like they did in Alabama. When we build something that can withstand whatever the earth or mother nature throws at it. Dan says disaster areas are where the blocks really shine, and where he gets a lot of business, because when it's all over, people want to know why one house survived and the rest didn't. That's not just wind either. Those blocks are also fireproof up to a few thousand degrees. Dan also says they're termite proof too. And Mark, it costs about as much as building your house out of concrete, but it could also save your life. Well, I'll tell you, a lot of people are going to start looking at those blocks. William, thanks.